hi guys welcome back to my channel thanks for tuning in today so it's been ages since i did like a vlog style sit at home and chat with you guys also i haven't finished my house tour since the last time that i did the kind of like half vlog half part of my house tour video so today i wanted to do a whole house tour for you guys vlog style and so um i also wanted to update you about a few things first thing i wanted to talk about was going off meat and cheese the video that i did just um a few weeks ago um that lasted for about a week and a half and then i had to go off that because i noticed that i was eating way too many carbs and that meant I'd get a, I'd gained a few pounds, which weight gain isn't literally anything that I want. So um, I kind of went off to re like to sort of like refigure out what I want to do. And basically, that what that helped me do that video it that decision that random decision to go off meat. Is that it's helped me start eating better I eat much much better I haven't gone back to tinned foods and like um, takeaways or any kind of like um, just you know you guys if you saw the video any kind of like crazy food that I was on I haven't gone back to that I'm eating fruit and veg and like preparing my meals homemade from scratch which so that video did help me in that like I have like reassessed the way that I eat my food. But yeah, so that was what I wanted to update you guys about. Another thing that I wanted to tell you guys about was um I wanted to ask you guys. Uh I like doing YouTube videos, but I it's extra special for me to do a YouTube video when you guys have requested it. So I know definitely somebody is out there looking for that information or somebody would actually like to see that video. So if you guys have any um, videos you would like to see me um, make, then let me know in the description below and I will try my best to do that for you. Um, yeah, so that is that. Without wasting any time, I actually wanted to just go straight into this video and show you guys the the other part of the other part of my house. Like I didn't show you guys what my bathroom looks like. I also didn't show you what the main bedroom in this house looks like. So I um, I'm gonna show you that today. Hopefully the light is okay because Belfast today is quite dull. And the only reason my light is semi okay right now is because I'm sitting right next to my window right here. But that should be fine. So I'll just take you around the house quickly and let you know what is um, going on. For starters, I'm going through like, um, I'm kind of like decorating for fall. You can see in my background there, there is like this um, rustic kind of pumpkins and like um, acorns and stuff. I still in the process of like um sort of like decorating for four because or any time i decorate for any season i always change it about and add more things so by the time it's actually four because four isn't like it's not really like i don't feel four four yet because i think four starts in september does it yeah i think so anyway but in september it's when it's really really dull and like really rainy outside and stuff usually here so that's when i will have my whole fall decor fully done usually i start though like i start a bit and because i don't want to do it all in one day so i started decorating for fall you guys might see for decor um items here and there that don't always hang in my in my sitting room but are only here for fall so yeah let's um get into another thing that i wanted to tell you guys is that that TV right there has now come down because basically I um it's in the it, it's usually in my bedroom and that's where it stays all fall and winter. But I brought it down because I've been sitting down here a lot more than I've been in my bedroom. I don't know, it's just change of kind of scenery. I get bored quickly in my bedroom, so I kind of like wanted this space and because I cook now, I kind of like need to keep an eye on my stuff. So I just felt like it's kind of like it's not gonna be here forever i love it in my bedroom i love to watch youtube videos and stuff first thing in the morning so no it's not like gonna be here forever 
but it's here now so ignore that that doesn't always stay here i am also you guys know i am on a minimalist journey right so i am reading um the uh, the joy of less a new book that i'm reading i will do a review on that when i'm done just like i did with my Marie Kon, um Marie Kondo books which were a great help so let's let me quickly get into this and do uh, sort of a tour I know maybe you guys who watched my first house tour this house is now different from what it was like a little bit different from what it was because obviously I am on a minimalist journey so I took down a lot of things that I didn't find useful anymore and that weren't important the first thing that went were all my pictures you will notice that excuse me you will notice that on my walls there's no pictures anymore there's kind of like things that I actually really like to see so let's start at the door and right here oh god that candle smells so good I will right here oh, sorry right here is um what this wall used to have a big picture if you guys can remember but I took that down I put this rustic kind of crate um, things up and there's just these two are like real cacti plants and then this is my decoration my owl decoration for fall this is a fake plant that is my rustic looking watch this is my um, my rustic um, iron that doesn't work obviously but it's just a decor item and then there's this right here which um, is like a lantern I really love these lanterns and then unattended children will be given espresso and a free puppy in here i love that and my rustic keys you guys will notice a lot of rustic things in here because i do love mixing like scandinavian design and like scandinavian minimalist design with um a bit of rustic charm so right here is a give thanks sign on my door right now and there is my four reef which i love it's so blankety feeling i love it and out here on the door is just the bags that I grab when I want to go out, maybe to the shop or something. Here are my, king, my keys hung. And then down here, there's my rack that I use to dry my clothes when I'm drying my clothes in the house. And there's also that bin right here. That's just um, my umbrella and my um, where I stuck my umbrella and just random stuff in there. Um, up here oops sorry up here i'm just showing you like at the to uh, really top is this um thing that reminds me very much of a victorian era in victorian travel times anyway that's what reminds me so i keep it up there i really really love it it's heavy and like bulky and i absolutely love my um my lampshade here in the doorway as you enter I also love here this are just this is just a random hanging that I like. I love this. Please remove your Jimmy shoes as well. And then this is just the light switch for when you are coming in at night and you need to see your way in. So that's what that looks like. And in case you guys are wondering, this right here, this window gets closed. I have blinds that I can just push down and stuff. So that um, gets closed at night just to give me a little bit of privacy and here is my sitting room so right here i'm just i was just having my coffee and i'm reading that book i showed you guys and i'm watching youtube as well like i'm interchanging between reading and watching youtube that is an owl in the window there that i've just put there as for decor as well i have put a carpet on the floor that will not be here all the time just during um, four because it just gives me a cozier feeling so that's there and then my coffee table and I've also got this uh, four I will do a whole four decor haul in a while when I'm finished getting all the things that I need to get that there is my four pillow that I really love it just says stay home and cuddle and I am burning this right oops <laughs> sorry you guys this is gonna be I hope it's okay but this is just my um, my calendar right here, and I need to change that, obviously. And then um, this is the candle that I'm burning. I'm burning uh, pumpkin spice. I love that for four, so it's really, really good. 
and this is just my set that I have right here that I really love as well. So this is just the TV that I have up in my bedroom but I've brought it down now for a while. By the way, that fireplace actually works. I do light it up in fall and winter, especially Christmas time. It's beautiful. Check it out on my Instagram. Um, I have pictures of it last Christmas. Um, up here is just my um, sort of DIY tools that I use to make DIY stuff. Like for instance, I made this um, decor thing here that just says thankful and it just hangs on my window. By the way, if you guys have watched my other um, home decor, my other home tour video, I said I hate that tank, this tank right there. That oil tank, I absolutely hate it, but I gotta deal with it. So, cause it spoils my view. Hopefully I can change to gas and that will go away from there. And then this, oops, this is just my cups that I really, really love. Like I did a whole video on it. They're so full and I use it for hot chocolate during fall and winter. So I like to keep them in here in the dining room. Sorry, going down there, this is just like some rustic decor items that I really love and also the twine that I use for a whole lot of um, decor stuff, um, DIY stuff. This is just a basket of my napkins and my table runner and stuff. The clutter of forks and spoons is a cookbook that I absolutely love. And then underneath there is just um, all my placemats that I use on my table. Also check Instagram to see how I use those on my table if you're wondering because they're chopping boards but I use them as placements. Here, to that side, is just three deer heads. You guys know about that. And then there's a flower at the bottom. I love my flow, by the way. I just really, really love it. And here is the sitting room looking away from it. Um, turning this way, under my stairs. This is the really funny, weird place under my stairs that I usually have no idea what to do with. It was packed with pictures before. But I have um, now put up that and removed every picture and fixed the wall. It was a mess. And then down here I have my radio. I have my um, candle holders that are tree trunks. Three of those. I have my cacti that are real. Apart from this one is a fake one, but one of them is actually a real cacti. So that's a real cacti. That's, and I use that, I just finished that candle and I use that for um, kind of like making a faux decor thing as well. And then underneath those stairs, there's, underneath those um, things, there's just more decor items that are just decor items. Down here, I have my broom. Oops, I'm trying to, yeah. Down here I have my broom and I have my two candle holders that I really love. Let me see if I can go down for you guys and show you what they look like. Yeah, that's them right there. So I really love these candle holders. Again, they're very rustic and I really, really love them. And the broom is kind of like rustic and old to me. I love that as well. Here, this is my dining table. Let's see if I can get in here. That's my dining table and that's the look at all, like what it looks like. Basically, coming into my kitchen, welcome to my kitchen, you guys. It's brighter right out, out here because I have this huge window right here, which I love. So it's brighter in here, obviously. But um, this drawer right here is just, oops, that's the pig holder. Anyway, in here, up there, I have my cook um, cards. They're just card stuff. And then these are my ice cream and little things that I put in, like dips and stuff like that. These are my el electrical tools, some of my electrical tools. This is my kind of like um, hot plate thing that I make burgers or meats on. And then this is um, my eggs, my egg holder at the back there that's full. And these are all just spices and they're spice jars. This is just like my spice rack um, situation right here for some of my spices. Down here, I have popcorn in that rice bag and I have um, just my favorite um, uh, motor and testo. 
down here there's bread and biscuits and down there there's more utensils so that's what is in that drawer then we have my cooker right here nothing in there up here quite messy but anyway just papers kitchen um, um, kitchen dish cloths and stuff like that stay in there here is my spice situation my other spice situation oops I'm trying to get a better angle yeah so these these are all my spices and then there's are more spices behind there and my salt at the stop I love this kitchen um, towel holder again it's wood and rustic which is a lot of things in my kitchen are that way this is my cooker it's touch screen I love it um, this is my coffee maker that I absolutely adore these are my um, breakfast bar chairs that I absolutely love and just underneath here I hmm, I can't show you is just this rustic basket that I'll show you properly with just onions and um, some potatoes up here is my basket um, my farmers market basket and I just have real veg and some fake fruit in it. I also have my dish cloth right here, hanging here, that I'm using to wipe, clean, dry my dishes. Up here is another faux decor. This used to say, but first coffee, but now I just have spice, uh, pumpkin spice latte and cinnamon tea served awful. And this is my fridge, which is not minimalist at all, because look at the, that fr those fridge magnets in my freezer. I can't really show you properly. There's nothing exciting here. Just drinks, veg. Oops, let's try and let me try and position this so that we can go in. Yeah, just veg there, drinks and stuff like that. Nothing that exciting. That's really um right here in my drawers. I have let's see. Okay, that's all that I have in my drawers, basically. My random cups here, oops, my random cups here, my cake stand holder, my gravy pour thing, my bowls, my teapot um, in there, and then my cup in there, my two, that's my friend's cup actually, my two um, um, wine glasses, my glasses which are jars, um, jam jars, tinned glasses i love they're like hot throb i love it up there is just a chicken a rum king thingy holder and an owl for fall up there down here is just um my sugar bowls oops i'm really really shaky hopefully this is okay to to upload um there's just that up here there's just dishes and stuff that I use every single day and these are just some of the kitchen utensils that I use every single day so that is my kitchen done right here on the kitchen door I have another thingy and a door another board kind of thing in a door oh I didn't show you here as well I won't show you all the drawers because literally there is this are uh, the next drawers random stuff in there um, pots in here can you see that at all pots in there <sighs> more pot and pot covers in there the, the down one um, spoons in here uh, maybe this one is worth showing oops that's just all my fruit and stuff holders my fridge holders that hold all my stuff um, more kitchen space my kitchen stuff spoons and more spoons oops that is a really loud drawer so that is my kitchen and can you see the rustic bucket in the background there oh yeah that's it where my fish stays going upstairs maybe I should just go upstairs like a normal person does oops that is just um I hope this is really good for you guys coming upstairs I won't really go into the drawers in here because literally it would take time to go through up here so we are in the bedroom this is a king queen bed queen bed beside it there is those two bed stands 
my Bible, my um, laundry basket, my bin, my emergency bin for in here, and my earphones. So that is the look at the bedroom and just the wall hanging that I showed in my um, thing right down there. I don't know if you can see. There's my teddy bear beside there and that's just the window. Um, when you look here, I moved this mirror. It used to be in my small room. It's here now. There's my bigger TV in here that I use when I'm in here and those are the drawers. Why am I out of breath? It's because I'm like literally running through this. There are my drawers down here. Up here is my basket. And in here is just all random stuff basically. Like candle, extra stuff, baby powder, my um, home cinema projector, extra bedding down there, and all that stuff. Here is my seat that I use for filming. When I film YouTube videos, I film in my other room. And I this is just my iPad. In here, I will not open the rest of it, but in here there's just more night stuff and laundry, another laundry basket there for my socks and stuff. That is clean laundry um, before it gets hung up. And yeah, that's so that's my bedroom and we're in the corridor. I have that sign in this corridor. I have another sign in this corridor, which might, these things might go out, but I don't know yet. And then... Coming this way, I have this to the door of my bathroom entry, and I also have that um, toilet bathroom sign. These right here are my drawers, and they just host extra, like, just extra stuff. Extra handbags, extra shoes down there, extra, uh, this is my hair, my babyliss hair dryer, and just pads and bathroom stuff right there. So does this. Right here, it holds kind of like all the stuff you see when you're coming up. Like extra toothbrushes, extra toothpaste. Why I did this is because I wanted my bathroom to be like a bit of a spa situation. So my bathroom is just, right there, it's just my um, toothbrush and my toothpaste sink down here, bin and my scale down that side. And then this is just the shower. Um, room nothing this is a really huge tub by the way really huge and then here is just my crab tree and Evelyn hand soap hand moisturizer and hand scrub so they stay in here if anybody wants to use it and I use it as well here is just my brush that thing that I love because it's rustic my tissue holder my tissue holder right here down there is just a few random stuff that I use for showering when I it's like a shower caddy, so I'll lift it and get into here. And then at the window, there's just my flowers, and I have my um, this um, thing around here that comes, it's down blinds just for privacy when you need it. Happiness is um, taking a hot bath there, and just welcome on board the wheel here. That is a look at my bathroom. Nothing, and then the rug down there, the toilet. Is right here that rug that um, it's like a bamboo kind of rug. So in here the decor was wood and white. That's what um, I wanted. You guys have already seen this room, the tour. It's changed since then. I have my bed right there, and I have that nightstand, and I have books under it that I read or something. My doorstop and my filming some of my filming equipment. Um, the window flowers. I have that board right here that's getting filled with stuff now, and then extra hangers on behind my door. And yeah, that's um, down here. I have all my other stuff that I, you know, my dresser and everything. And right here is where my TV goes, but there is no TV now because it's downstairs, like I showed you guys. So yeah, that is my house tour. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I tried to like speed it up for you guys because I didn't want you guys to spend ages here. So yeah, hopefully if I rushed through anything too much and you want to see like a full detailed room tour of this bedroom right here, let me know about it and I will do that for you guys. But 
for now have a nice day and i will see you guys in a bit Mwah. thanks for tuning in